Last video, we went through creating a membership. I will now show you how to apply that to videos and video categories. So after creating a membership, you can go to videos in the admin and just say all videos. Edit one of the videos that you want to apply a membership to. And look for the access options tab. In this section you will see membership access, purchase price, and rental price. So to apply that membership that we just created, just check that box and click the update button. This video will now require that a visitor has this membership in order to watch it. You'll notice that you can check multiple membership plans here. So for example, I might want this video to be available to everyone on the day, week, and test membership plan. But I may have another video that only users on the test membership plan can get access to. This allows you to do sort of a gold, silver, bronze where um, you would have different priced memberships and depending on which membership the user has, they'll have access to a different set of videos. The purchase price, you can simply just enter what you want people to pay. So I'll just keep that at $14.95. Rental price, let's do $250. And then you can also set when does this expire. So let's say 24 hours. And you can do hours, days, week, months. And this obviously is the time from when the customer makes the purchase or rental and when that video access expires for them. Note that all of these are optional. So you don't have to set a purchase price. You don't have to set a rental price. Um, what it, whichever options are filled in will show on the front end. So I'm going to save this, press update. And I will preview this video. And by default as an administrator, you will get full access to the video. So, you know, if I come here and I play, I'm going to see the video. However, if you press this no access preview, which as says here, only site administrators can see this, that means that no other user or visitor is going to see this button. This can be used to preview what the video looks like for users that don't have access. So you'll notice now I am on the no access preview. So when I press play, I'll see the subscription and payment options that I filled in. So subscribe, there's the test membership box that I've checked here, $14.95. That's the purchase price, rental. And you notice that the pricing and form automatically updates. A couple other things I'll mention. Um, the free for registered users, that means that visitors that are not logged in will not be able to watch the video, but anybody who has an account and is logged in will be able to watch the video for free. Another useful tool is the bulk edit. So say for example, I want to apply a membership to four videos or all of them. I'm going to select these four, go to bulk actions, edit, apply. Now you can actually choose the test membership, press update. And now any of these videos that I just edited will have the test membership applied to them. And the last thing I'll go through is the membership settings and pricing for categories. So let's go to, doesn't really matter, let's, let's do the cooking show. So if you edit a category, 
you can also set one of your memberships to be required for this category or a purchase price. Categories don't have rental prices right now, um, but if you set a membership to a category, us users will get access to all videos within that category. If you set a purchase price and a user purchases this category, they will get access to all videos within that category. And that's it for this video, guys. I'll see you in the next one.